Howdy and what's going on? This is the White Tiger here and today we're going to be doing a little bit of building, a little bit more derping as usual, but uh, a while ago in another video I sat there and made a very bold statement to where uh, my body armor that I'm wearing pretty much makes me indestructible. <clears throat> Now, excuse me, by the way, uh, while some of that is sort of true, especially now, uh, between uh, the last episode and this one, I have died numerous times. Well, numerous being a couple, but anyways, I did die <coughs> a couple times, and uh, when that happened, uh, I decided I wanted to do some upgrades on my body armor, so I just want to show what all I did very quick to it before we get started on today's couple projects but uh, I don't know how long this video is going to be Oop, I went right past it but we'll see what happens alright so uh, used to be I just had this on with just uh, the efficiency solar generators regular solar generator and a lead battery but I had the battery size turned all the way down so because of that I do I believe the situation was that the generators uh, sat there and caused me to catch fire whenever I get out into the sun. So basically it would be ultimately killing me and such. So uh, anyway, so I got all my stuff back and made the battery size a little bit bigger for each the suits, the helmet, and the leggings, and everything else. I have all the kinetic generators and all that good chiswiz whatever from the other suits. But <clears throat> and uh, Better on this one and all that stuff, but yeah. So that seems to be pretty stable right now. Uh, however, I just want to really test out this theory. And also, I think I showed y'all guys this the last time. I was so proud of this. My little mob factory. Well, it blew up due to a creeper, of course, freaking creepers. So I have to sit here and rebuild this. I'm probably gonna. Alright, I'm back. I uh, had a little bit of a hiccup there. Well, it was more like a crash, but anyways, I was saying I was going to make this all bigger, but uh, we'll get that to that in a little bit. <coughs> I'm sorry about that. Uh, also made me a couple more tools. I went ahead and made a flux and fuse shovel, and I uh, also have here a flux and fused sword. And also went ahead and got a thermometer, thermometer, the thermometer, yeah, thermometer, and uh, got started a little bit on thermcraft. I was just doing mainly research and stuff. I'm not doing anything major, incredible or anything, but yeah, thermcraft is. Yeah. All right, and we're back. Just ignore the numbers in the bottom right hand corner. They do not exist. Woo. Uh, anyways, uh, you also notice, hopefully, by now, I think my icon in the little, uh, upper right-hand corner of the screen should be a lot smaller now, so that way you can see more of what's going on, because I hate it when I watch videos, I can't see what's going on, but anyways, uh, let's see, uh, whoops, it is done, Cloud Sword, I got it renamed, it worked, um, I just went ahead and went berserk with it, and threw a bunch of sharpness on there. I did put a diamond and a golden block to give it an extra modifier, but uh, I just used the flux. Uh, I put. I went ahead and used that flux capacitor that I had and went ahead and just put that on the sword just because it was simpler and easier. I could just make another one in the AE. But uh, yeah, so I'm gonna go charge this bad boy up and we're gonna take it out for a spin. and test out with these necklaces and see because the ne the necklaces now everybody's wondering why I have gripes with the necklaces like uh, why why I thought originally was if I put all these necklaces in my inventory <coughs> naturally excuse me they should uh, just make me overpowered like crazy right well that's what I thought too because now everything's just all bright and lit up and you can see it I'm you know, fast as I don't know what, and good lord, that's that's crazy, but that's cool. <laughs> Anyways, uh, but yeah, you think this would make me, you know, a buff, super buff, and everything, but uh, one of the pendants ha is regen, uh, another one is like strength or resistance or something like that. Anyways, all these pendants actually go on to mobs, 
like if I get close enough to a mob or whatever I can have they'll actually get the uh, potion effect or whatever effect from a pendant from me therefore like regenerating mobs and stuff and I'm gonna try to give you a quick demonstration and see if I can't uh, there's a zombie maybe it's on down or something there's a creeper around here somewhere see if I can find them. What you, whenever you need mobs they're not around and whenever you don't need them they're around okay so let's do the old tried and true uh, anyways that was a bad example very very bad okay there's some stuff oh hey Pulan yeah uh, forgot Pulan is on the server and oh well whoever just came on just left <laughs> anyway so back on to what uh, I was trying to do if I can find an actual mob to test this theory out with the geostrata crystal pendants it's a good idea in theory but like I said they just give the mobs uh, some of the effects too so I'm just kinda gliding through and see if I can't have some mob just spawn near me or something cause just crap just what the oh wow okay crap just happens but yeah anyways okay uh you know what uh i'm wait i'm taking too long i can't find any mobs so let me cut out and i'll come back in right quick I'll be right back you know what I just thought of? We can just try with the old tried and true method. Even though it's half broken, it'll still give us a couple mobs to kind of play around with and toy around with. Hopefully it won't spawn out any creepers, so it'll just blow crap up again. But we'll see. See? See, look at this. Okay, so normally, at least this sword would just, you know, normally annihilate them. At least not give just one hit. And look how fast he is. Normally them things are fast as it is but there that dude was super fast but anyways uh oh yeah the curse started all the light and stuff around it. Uh, I don't know if this will work or not I know night vision is uh, I have that on but I know some of this oh oh my god 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 no 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 back off back the frick off Come on now. Uh, I don't care about you, but you just back the frick off. I hate you guys. See, look at that. Ah, oh, God, whatever. See, look at this crap. Okay, see, watch. Okay, see, I know I need to be hitting him for a lot harder. Now, watch this. Flux and fuse. Huzzah! Come on. Look at that. Only three points? Really? Really? See, that's some bull. So, that's why I decided I needed to make me some better tools because I want a tool that I could sit there and hit something even with these pendants on even with all these pendants on and not have any problems so now we're gonna go t uh, charge this thing up and go test it out <clears throat> this is actually kinda interesting now this also gives me mining fatigue, but with all the stuff that I have right now, that shouldn't matter too terribly much. Yeah, disabled, ignored, okay. Okay, 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 good. So this t shouldn't take too terribly long to charge. While we're doing that, or waiting for that or whatever, uh, ooh, ooh, I forgot completely. Uh, this auto enchanter, I th I think I was talking about, oh, that was another introduction video that I messed up on and didn't work. Anyways, I made this, and uh, I thought it worked on the XP that I was building up from all this stuff here, but no, it turns out it only uses mob essence, so that's, yeah, that's right, that's right, I said that in the other video, uh, that was the reason why I built that little mob factory thing down there in the basement or whatever, so, yeah, okay. Oh yeah, I got some oil. I went and found some oil somewhere. I can show you that right quick. I only got 155 buckets and then accidentally got some lava in there, so... Oops, but whatever. Yeah, let's go see some oil right quick. Uh, waypoints. NB Snooky's first base. Yeah, I, I want to show y'all that in a little bit, but first, oil. Before we get the...
cleaver. Okay, so anyways, yeah, this is where I've been finding the oil. Now, all this, this was nothing but oil right here, and it all got drained out in 155 buckets. So there's another oil spurt. There's another oil spurt. And then over here, I think, is the second one? Whoop, uh-oh. Second one somewhere. There it is. Okay, hiding back here. Whoop. And it's not working. It should be. It's getting power. Oh, because the energy tank got derp. Derpy dee derp 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 derp. Oh, it's done. I'll reach all the way out here. I'll just oh. Alright, let's see if I can fix this right quick. Without too much of a hassle. Come on. Give me that. Thank you. Oh have you ever noticed people sit there and say thank you to things or whatever? Now is that input or output? That's output. We want input. Yeah. There we go. Okay, yeah, there we go. That's what we want to say. Okay, yeah. Okay, cool. Alright, so, but anyways, you ever notice how people tend to be a lot nicer to Minecraft machines and they say thank you to crafting benches and things of that nature? It's just kind of weird, but, eh, whatever. Uh, so yeah, okay, that's gathering up again. Sweet, so let's go back home. A little cheaty cheaty, but, eh, whatever. And yeah, buddy, that's what I'm talking about. Yeah, cool. We're gonna use some oil for some stuff, getting into stuff later, but let's see, how is our. It's almost charged up. Golly, that thing takes a long while to charge up. I'm kind of surprised, too, because it usually doesn't hold that much of a charge. Well, at least the Leadstone Energy. Uh, Leadstone Energy. Portable battery cell? I don't know what to call it. Let's just look it up. Because we can make one in the AE. Oh, yeah, let's make one. Let's know flux capacitor. Flux capacitors. Think like Back to the Future. Flux capacitor, Marty McFly. <laughs> 80s kid, then you know what I'm talking about. If you're not, then you're like, uh, what? But anyways, okay, so that's charged up now. I need to go put my book back. And I just want to put, yeah, I'll put that back. Uh, I drained all my quartz. I even went and got my nether quartz and put it all into blocks of quartz just for that sword. So that sword better be worth something. Uh, I need to put it back in the table to see what all it can, what all the uh, statistics are, I guess you'd call it. I don't know. Whatever. The thingy's on it. How gravy it is, like how many hearts it can do, attack damage, and whatever, whatever. Okay, 14.5 is not as much as I thought it would be, like I saw in the video, but, eh, whatever. It's got a bunch of quartz on it, it's flux, it's maxed out, so, eh, we're going to get the sucker spin anyways. Alright, so I got all the pendants I got that regular body armor. I want to test on normal mobs first, then we're going to try to see if we can get Pewland. Oh, cool. And I was going to try to get Ambi Snooky in with us as well, but I think it might be a little too late for him, but we'll get Pewland on in, in on this and see if we can't go to the Twilight Forest and find a boss or two. Now, the main reason why I put Ars Magica into here... God, not another creeper! Huh? Uh, let's see. Alright. Huzzah! Six! Six! Really? And then he still sits there and... Oh, really? Really, 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 really? Son of a biscuit eater. What ifs? Uh, at least it was only two blocks. Okay, so all this crap... See, this is why I, I kind of don't really care for Tinker's Construct too much. I mean, it's okay for some people that know what they're doing and have been messing with this for a long while, but for noobs, it's just, eh, you read the research on it, and then you're just like, okay, well, you know, I want the graviest stuff on there, and it turns out the graviest stuff don't really work. So, you know, like a cleaver, like I said, had mining fatigue. I was expecting that, but... I don't know. I just, I really expected a lot more bang for my buck than what I have right now. According to all this, this is like, supposed to be like the best one. Oh, God. I hear, oh, Lord, oh, Lord, oh, Lord, oh, Lord. I, oh, son of a, yep. 
super derp move on that on my part on that one. Okay, yeah, I gotta get rid of this crap. Okay, turn that off. Scary stuff's coming out. Oh god, one of them think uh trying true is not gonna help me. Oh god, 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 oh Go the hell away. You are not wanted here. <sighs> this is annoying as crap. <sighs> Son of a... See, he just recharges everything. Just bloody recharges. I mean, regenerates, recharges. Yeah, they're all machines, and they all get recharged by battery. But look at this. He's not even like... Ah, oh, God! <sighs> Such is my life. Whatever, I was gonna rebuild it anyway, so I had to hell with it. Now the heck, ah, uh, heck, oh. yeah, I knew I hurt his ass. Kill you! Ah, uh, huzzah! Death! Yes, haha. -ha. Okay, that was a little easier than I thought. Okay, mobs cleaned out of the base. Okay, good. Now everybody's starting to understand the reasons for the holes in the floor and everything. It's random creepers. <laughs> but yeah, okay. Anyways, um, back to what we were doing. Okay, so the test failed on regular mobs. So, dang, what's even the point of going to the Twilight Forest, I guess? Oh yeah, well, let's at least just take off the pendants. Uh, clean this up a little bit. And Let's see. I know that one makes you stronger or resistant, resilient. Now, I need this one. That makes me not hungry. Uh, so, I want that one. The blue one I want to be able to see and stuff. Yeah, that's what I thought. Orange, I'm not sure what that does. Now, magenta is the regen. Yeah, I definitely got to put that one up. Light blue makes it speedy, and this gives me haste, and that makes me jump higher. I think this one makes me, allows me to breathe underwater. So let me put those two up. And I think this gives me fire resistance, which I really don't care about with the mobs or anything. So let me do a dump. I <laughs> do a dump. That's why I always called it uh, doing a dump of my inventory and getting rid of unwanted things. So do that right quick. I don't know why I'm going so slow. But apologize, everybody. It's late at night, and I'm ugh, just about ready to go to bed here soon, but... Alright, so... Back to the regular body armor. And... I don't even know why I'm going this way. I can just... Oh, yeah. Um, first of all... Anyways, um, kind of curious to go into the nether a little bit. We can just wait for his response. And we'll just go ahead and go on into the nether. Oh yeah, I forgot I need to put block there. Block, uh, potential security risk in the old base. Uh, now also, yeah, that's right, these things give me reverse effects, uh, keep forgetting about that. Yeah, another thing with Geostrata, if you go, oh yeah, check this out, not only does the nether, but, um, I may be a swarm, <laughs> oh yeah, the morph, um, uh, one sec, uh, anyways, um, uh, about the pendants, and the neither, they're all reversed, so say like if you have haste, it'll give you slowness and, uh, hunger, you know, make you hungry instead of feed you well or whatever, so... Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, back off. Ah, come on. Okay, see, that's that's a little bit better. One hit kill. Well, of course, that's for these things, but... Let's see, let's see. Yeah, here we go, here we go. Here's a good... Oh, yeah, okay. Okay, so the sword doesn't really suck that much. It's just the pendants make it kind of suck because the monsters regen. But, yeah, otherwise, that's, that's pretty good. I just got withered and didn't really feel it too much. So, I think the body armor is pretty well 
pretty well got me covered now, so we are about ready to go into the twilight and test this stuff out after all. This is pretty cool. Alright, yeah, here we go. Lobbers. Yeah, they got like 80-something. Yeah, yeah, that's what I like to see. Yeah. Yes, sir. Alright. Now you gotta see it. <laughs> Heck, really, uh... Eh, really not doing anything. I tried to think of something clever and I couldn't think of it. Huh. So let's get old Pulan up and go to the twilight and see what's crack a uh, Whoa! Oh yeah, I forgot. Uh, that is not the options button. <laughs> uh, Lyles. That recorded. <laughs> Alright, so let's take this out of my hands for now. Yeah, alright, so. Ready whenever you are, Mr. Pulin. Pulin, Pulan, Pulin. Can I make a quick jackpack or stay as a swarm? What do you think? Stay as swarm. The entire reasoning behind installing the morph mod uh, tiny dick face <laughs> uh, I'm sorry you have to forgive me I'm, the reason I say that uh, there's an ongoing joke uh, with the media log German man and uh, gaming on caffeine and uh, <laughs> uh, gaming on caffeine used to send him little signs or whatever, and he'd put the equal sign, little D, like that, to try to make a little smiley face, sideways face. And Meteor Lock would be a jerk and say tiny penis face or something like that. So, <laughs> anyways, um, I just completely forgot what. Okay, yeah, derp. Okay, here we go. TP Mr. Pulan to the. Now, does this work? Oh, it does work. Okay, so it's tab. If you type in part of somebody's name and then hit the tab button, it finishes it for them. Uh. Oh yeah, I got the Coin of Fortune on. I'm sitting here, I forgot I'm even recording, uh, sort of. Uh-oh. Huh? Okay, yeah. That's fine. I wanted him to show him Cloud Sword. Oh, oh okay, that button does that. Okay, because I know Tab does that, but I have a Nostromo gamepad that I use. That uh, You have to look up Nostromo, N-O-S-T-R-O-M-O, -O, speed pad, N52. That's an old, old uh, Belkin type gamepad, but uh, it still works and it does what I need it to do. And I'm just sitting here derping around talking and just not even moving or nothing, so apologies. While we're waiting for Mr. Pulan, and let's do something a little interesting, I guess. Okay, with my Emmy system at hand. Dang it. Now he tells me right after. That's okay. Enderman save for another day. <sighs> My new piece. <laughs> <sighs> Hopefully, we can find boss or a maze. Whoops, or a A's. Sir, sharp and powered up. Yep. All right. And here we are. Loaded up and waiting for Mr. Poulin. Oh, 
he's already here somewhere. I just can't see him. That happens every now and again. I'll notice that, like, okay, maybe he's up in the trees or something. I see him. And we're back. Uh, this is a very big rarity. We have Seashield and 69 on. What's up, dude? <laughs> we got everybody on tonight, it looks like. We got AMB Snooky, we got PLN's back, he recovered from a crash, and now C. Sheldon's on. Hey, everyone. Recording. Hey. Hey. Anyways, uh, so yeah. Oh, there's Pulin. All right, going to Twilight. Whoever wants to come, meet in my base basement. <laughs> going to Twilight. Whoever wants to uh, come with me, come on, let's go. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, there he is. He already got down here. Oh, he already went in. So we're going to wait for him, so that way hopefully the server will load the Twilight correctly for him. And waiting for C. Sheldon, and hopefully EMB will join us too. That will be surreal. <laughs> but anyways, uh, yeah, should have been enough time. I think Chris saw where I went to. I call him Chris, but C. Sheldon 69, whatever. His name's Chris, so it's okay. Come on, all you got there you go, dude. Alright, come on. Over here. Come on. Yeah, there we go. Huh. Alright. Hopefully it doesn't crash for everybody going through. Alright, we're here. There's Pew Land. Alright. <laughs> oh no. We lost somebody. Uh, Chris crashed out, looks like. Dang it. Well, we're going to pause the video for a second. So, again. All right, and we're back again. Uh, we got Chris, uh, C. Sheldon 69 with us. And Pewland here. Uh, when we got here, we just made a quick little community base. It's just a little sign here. But mostly it was just me having dug out a little bit of dirt and putting all this uh, out. That's all. Oh yeah, the little crafting bench, crafting table, station, whatever. Saw this and wanted to know what this was, so I'm gonna get it out right quick. Hold on. That's interesting. Let's see. Dirt. Reinforced dirt from chisel. That's actually kind of cool. Uh, whoops. Uh, yeah, let's see. It's weird, but anyways, uh, we're sitting here derping out and not really doing anything, so let's get to doing something. We were here to try to find reinforced dirt for nuclear apocalypses. <laughs> so I love you, Lem, man. He's funny as crazy. Uh, he just, ah, uh, if he only had more videos, but that's okay, because his editing is takes some time and it's worthwhile when everything gets done and over with. Never leave home without it. Oh, that's kind of cool. Oh, so that's how it was made. Derp in this. So let's go find a boss. Let's go find a boss. Oh, 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 and get stuck in trees. And there's a ghost over there. Ooh, let's go kill him. Die. Fool. Come here. You are mine. I don't know who you Oh! Oh, I am my Twilight Hunter. Yes, now I can have his form. And since I'm here, I might as well have a wild deer form, too. Yes. Ooh, leather. Don't mind if I do. Thank you. Oh, what, 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 what do we have here? That was a lot of what's all at once, sorry. 
but it's just interesting what we have here. Where's everybody? I think I done took off without it, without anybody. Man, see that reminds me over there. Ah, uh, shoot. I can't do that right. Z, Z. Okay, there's my map. It's back. Okay. Now that looks like something of uh, dimensional doors and was it uh, Technic or whatever. I love dimensional doors. I love that mod. I wish I could get that in here. I tried, believe me, but it just would not work. So, yeah. Sorry, I keep derping on just talking random about junk that don't matter. But I'm trying to wait for the guys to show up too they just like kind of disappeared on me or I kind of disappeared on them so shh <laughs> we'll let them believe it's their fault marble to mind if I do ooh cute little bunny thank you <laughs> that was funny get a few resources okay I'm derping out I'm getting resources that I don't need on camera wasting everybody's time Okay, let's go back. Okay, so we're on this hill. And I know that there's got to be something in here. Because there's a bunch of creepy looking things. Uh. Near a large dirt mountain. Right? Oh god, not another. Uh, yep, meteor. Yep, there it went. Uh, let's see. Our magnetic force. Why not just do this? TP. Whoa. Okay, and boom. Okay, there's Chris. Boom. And there's Pulan. <laughs> nice. Alright. Let's see here. What do we got here? What futuristic? Futuristic. I can't spell. Okay. Uh, anyways, let's... Never dig straight down in Minecraft. Er. Never do it. Yeah, that's what I'm doing. I don't care. Oh, that's the reason why. But that's why I have a jetpack. Ha <laughs> ha. Okay, so I will need some night vision because I can't see Jack in here. There we go. All right. Give me speed. Give me haste. I don't care if the other mobs get it. Give me some hunger or lack of hunger and we'll just do with all the rest of the stuff eh, yeah whatever okay huzzah let's go find some mobs to kill oh yeah black thing there's a spawner oh up 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 and yes Let's kill some mobs. Yes! Oh, very nice. Ho, ho, ho. He, he, he. Yes, that's me as actually doing that, not the mobs. <laughs> whoa! TNT, TNT. Uh. Whoa. Up, 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 up. Back up. Back the heck up. Go on. Go on with yourself. Ah! Go on with yourself. Go on. Go on with yourself. Go on. Go on. Go on. Oh yeah, he's hit. My night vision is kind of act. Oh, that's why. Cause of that one a bit. Oh, what the? Whoa. Okay. Uh. Okay. Yes. Lots of skeletons. Lots of stuff. Ah.
torch berries, transformation powder. Ooh, kind of like the sound of that. But I want to leave them some stuff, so like I'll take five of them, I guess, and leave a tunic. <laughs> I'm so mean, ain't I? <laughs> Ooh, some more stuffs. All right. Ooh, entropy. Uh, I know I'll need that stuff for Thalcraft for later, so let me do a dump right quick. Dude, this is kind of interesting. I'd like to see what else this thing will, uh, this body arm will save me from. So, I'm sorry I say, dude, I just, I don't mean to, raw venison. But, yeah, anyways, uh, I want that dirt, and, yeah. I'm getting this, huzzah, huzzah, huzzah. Huzzah. Yeah, other people sit there and say, don't use that, get, uh, silk touch on it, and go macerate it, but I don't care, whatever. Ooh, there's lots of lapis. Oh my god. It's so much lapis I want, so I want it. I don't care. Yo. Yeah. Yep. I want the lapis. I don't even care. Oh, I'm... Okay, okay, I'm derping out. Huh. <laughs> Puzzle. Back off. Oh, I want that thumbcraft note. Oh, mine. I called it. I so called it. Back up. Back up off of me. Whatever you're doing. Ha! Snatch. It's mine. My thumbcraft note. Ah, painter. Go away. Oh, buddy, sounds like he's in trouble. Chris is. Uh go away. Alrighty, let's see what's in here right quick. Ooh, piece of pie. Naga scale. I'm gonna snatch that just because. And there's a pinch beetle that's trying to take me away from my treasure. Uh, a bunch of other stuff that I really don't need. And another pinch beetle. That's the whole reason why I created those cleavers, because they're getting regen on their own. From Well, see, I gave Chris some uh, necklaces, because I made, I just gave him my original necklaces, I got copies of it. And well, I have time to regen. Well, let me see. He says that the string pin, I think that's the string pin, it. So let's try that then. Let's see if that'll help out. I know that's resistance. Resistant ones that counters the effect. Well then I don't know which one. Uh I'm gonna put them all on. I know that's jump. I know that's regen, so Huzzah. FTW, you only live once, YOLO, and all that good stuff. Get back. Get back. Yeah, now I got fire resistance on me. This is awesome, though. It just seems like, no matter what, I'm gonna go find an actual good boss, though, like a Naga or, uh... I would really like to find a maze. That'd be awesome. Ooh, magnet. It's mine. Ironwood pickaxe. Okay. Ooh. Ow. Ow. <laughs> Whoa. That was a big, huge glitch there, but that was okay. Ow. 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 Oh. <laughs> oh. 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 I hate this slim thing. Ooh. Now I got his morph. Go away, skeleton. Nobody likes you. Nobody wants to be you. You don't even want to be you. Ooh, more transformation power. Don't mind if I do. 
That's all mine. Thank you. <laughs> I'm so evil. I need to give everybody some stuff. I can't be taking everything. Oh god, not another freaking Enderman. God. Okay, and we're back. It was a weird glitch there, but I think I got it fixed for the moment. Um, yeah, anyways. So, we pretty much cleaned this place out, it looks like. Let's go ahead and let's try to find a soul with a, a your ghast. <coughs> do that. So I like this place. Let's mark this first. Uh, new waypoint. Oh god, I forgot to make an exit waypoint. Whatever. Uh, resource. Resources. I can't spill. Done. Back again. standing around, otherwise it gets boring for everybody, don't it? Uh, oh, I gotta take some more of this. I'm sorry. I've gotta have some more of that transformation powder. I don't know what it does, but it sounds cool. And that looks weird. Can't kill him? Okay, never mind. Uh, let's get on out of here. Let's see if we can get... Uh, I think we're just gonna mine straight up. And FTW. Oh god, no, 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 no. Piss off. Oh, well, I'm not supposed to say that, I guess, but... Go away, I guess. That's the best way to say it. Maybe kite. Okay. Here we are. He's got the picture. Yeah, he's falling. Okay, cool. Now, let's go find something, man. Let's go find something. I know not everybody's watching this as a man, and if you take offense to it, I'm sorry. But I'll just call everybody dude, man, or what have you. Uh, let's try to see if we can look at the map. I have the Opus map writer on, so that might be able to help us out if I can get the right key. Which I would have changed it. Oh goodness, I don't. Oh, that's the Galacticraft map. That's not it. Ah, that's not it. That's not it. I was going to be sitting here fiddling with stuff all night. Better not do that. So let's just see if we can just look around for some stuff. How about this? I'll just cut out, and then when we find something, we'll cut back in. I'll be right back. All right, I'm right as soon as I cut out, it looks like our buddy has found a Hydra, so we're going to go ahead and go TP to him. Seashell to... Whoops, no, 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 no. The White Tiger to Seashell. There we are. Yes, yes. All right, Hydra. So, whoa. Holy junk. Okay. So he was right behind me. That was kind of cool, but whoa. Golly. Uh, really? Wow. This sword does some more damage than I thought. God. It used to take forever to kill these suckers, man. Or dude. Woman. Uh, dude as well. And, uh, Whoever's watching it uh, besides me, because I said earlier that I'm the only one that watches my videos. Well, it does seem like uh, that other people are watching it, so that's pretty cool. I appreciate that, so I'm sorry for sounding like a selfish jackass. Uh, yeah.
<laughs> but anyways, the Hydra is now dead. Yay! <laughs> I'm serious about that. I added Ars Magica to. <laughs> but yeah, okay, so our tests are complete, and I guess that'll about wrap it up for right now. So. Uh, you know what, yeah, it wraps it up a little bit, but I think we're going to go to Mr. Chris's base. Oh, uh, oh, thumb nose. I'm going to get down, but yeah, let me cut out of here and I'll be right back, okay? <laughs> okay, I had to cut right back in. Uh, Pulan just built but this, yeah, uh, built this, and I just thought it was kind of cool, I mean, what and all that expensive expensive or pract or you know huge or whatever but I think it's pretty cool and I just had to cut back in right quick uh, and show you all that cool hydra stuffs all right let's see what we got hydra chops we like that fiery blood we'll take some of that sure I'm sure we can come up with something for stuff like that later on later on Naga scale and that orb magnet that's gonna be kind of cool but we'll mess with that later so who wants the trophy uh, uh, put it at spawn if I ever get around to building it. Bulls. Okay, TP. Wait, you know what? No, no, no. Home. Home we go right quick. Because I just want to show what happened. Oh my god, really? 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 Oh, thank goodness I was at least recording this, because this is some of that old bull crap. Man. Ah. Uh. Lowls. I. I had to sit there and say that. That was just funny. Uh, but, yeah. That, that's just... No! Oh, no. Whoops. I forgot about that. Even though the blocks aren't there, the portals are active, so... Uh, we're going to... Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Media and germs. Uh, old server world. Yeah, I'm really disappointed that uh, Media Lock and German Man decided to stop their monster series. So, it looks like... Uh, we have the only copy of the server, or part of the server anyways, whatever, but, yeah, man, this is some crap, man, I'll have to go rebuild this and everything now, so, yeah, whatever, uh, so, uh, yeah, everybody knows about all that good stuff, whatever, whatever, and, oh yeah, back here is where he used to be. Now there was this meteor that hit down here and just kind of leveled everything over here. You remember the last few episodes that uh, poor Chris uh, had a whole bunch of stuff built over here and now most of it's all gone. Like a few of his chests are here still and whatever but that meteor flattened everything. I went ahead and dug it out and it was kind of enough to steal all the resources from him. <laughs> but yeah, so instead now, uh, his Tesla quills, that's right. Uh, so now he went and moved over here, Sheldon's base. That's, that's nice. Uh, whoops. Okay. Come on. There we go. Guest food. He's so nice. He's so considerate. He puts up uh, pictures of food everywhere for guests. <laughs> But nah, uh, guest tools and weapons, as you can see, guest items enjoy. Fishing rod, yeah, that's right, I need to get fishing and stuff. Uh, 
Ooh, a naga. People have found a naga. And ooh, he's got ender pearls. Oh, 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 I forgot. You're not supposed to. I put those ender pearls in there. But it actually finally grew. So plant whatever you like in the farmland for the guests. And here's his room with mariculture. And those squid look pretty cool looking, if I do say so myself. Uh, yeah, this is where all his. Oh no, that's his. Hazmat suit? So, oh, that must be his regular armor. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, and back here we got the guest lodging house area. Okay, and yes, I like to show off people's bases. Can't you tell? <laughs> Reactor room. Hazmat suit for the guests. Danger radioactive zone. Must wear a hazmat suit beyond this point. Not really, but it's fun to pretend because that's what Minecraft is all about. Shh. <laughs> canning machine. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember why he needs a canning machine. Okay, so yeah, there's his little display. He decided to just put in one display instead of a big, huge one. So yeah, there's that and the pumpkin temple. Now this is a cool place, uh, as you can see. Yeah, uh, Cropmatron. I think I showed this in another video or something like that. I can't remember. Maybe I was showing it in like a preview video or something. I don't know. But anyways, yeah, the Cropmatron, I think that's where he gets some of his power from. If I'm not mistaken, I'm going to have to go back and ask him. But if that's the case, then we're going to have to figure out how he did this and kind of duplicate what he did. But all this is is a drawbridge from Tinker's Mech Works, which I help him make, because it's hard as hell to make, well, actually impossible to make, without the Tinker's Construct table, so, yeah. But all in all, I'd say he's doing pretty good, because we're all, like, used to be a bunch of cheaters and stuff, like, well, not really cheaters, we just created mode Minecraft so much that we just got used to it, and we just build weird things, you know, just make machines and stuff like that and then we just decided to actually try to do it in survival and actually gather resources ourselves and here we are so I think we're actually doing not too bad this time but whoops great job on the base yo uh, let's see Whoa. Uh-oh. Is this his base? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Whoops. Spoilers now. <laughs> That's for sure. Well, I'm going to look around anyway, so I won't go anywhere and really look around too terribly much, but God, look at this dude. He is serious about his stuff, man. I tried to back before you teleported. Oh, no. Let's try this again. Yes, okay. Back on track. So, we got a little bit of a sneak peek of Peel in space, so shh, don't tell anybody. Okay. Naga. Wow. So, that's what a Naga looks like. So, that's what it looks like. I've never seen one before. Oh, that's cool. Now he is hard a bit, cause golly, look, whoa, 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 whoa. Hey, come on. Lag? No. Not lag. Yeah, I didn't think it was the server lagging. Wow. Come on, Cloud Sword, don't fail me now. Come on. Come here. Hey. Quit eating stuffs. And stuffs. I can just charge up to you, pretty much. Serpent, so it's serpent. Okay, so I don't care what Google says. Ah, sweet. I get the Naga head and the scales. Sweet, 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 sweet. 
so long as it's killed. One of these days we're going to get everybody into actual voice chats, that way we can talk to them through voice instead. Oh, where's my other block mover? I have another block mover. Yes! Another Thongcraft node! Oh, that was very annoying loud nodes. I apologize. Sorry about that. But yeah. Ooh, another Thongcrafty node. I better go home and go pop these down right quick. But anyways, I'm sure y'all don't want to see me do all that. But yeah, you can move Thongcraft nodes with the block movers. I think I said that in a previous episode. But And we're back again. Uh, look at what Mr. Pulin found for us. Seems he found us a Eurogast a castle here. <laughs> this is awesome. So, Eurogast. But yeah. <clears throat> Excuse me. Cool. Alright. Yeah. Exactly how tall this fool thing is. Goes all the way the crap up. But yeah, we're gonna fight this sucker. Yep, there he is. Yeah. Come here, you. No, not a pickaxe. I, my weapon. My weapon of destruction. I go flying through him. Come on. Oh no. So my weapon is useless. I had to throw things back at him. Oh my god, he is loud. He is very well. God. I have never seen one of these like really up close and personal. Like I've seen kind of one or two or something, but, I mean, well, one or two, yeah, that makes total sense. God, I've never seen one's facts, though. That's for damn sure. Oh, my God. Anyways, it's just amazing. I'm just, it's huge, and it's just, wow. That's all I gotta say. What did he, go away, go away, go away. Yep. Ow, 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 ow. Oh, 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 I'm getting hit. I'm getting hurt somehow. Come on. Is it really gonna hurt me? Am I really gonna die? Or is this body over gonna save me? Oh, yeah, it's the nether. I don't have daylight to save me with. <laughs> okay, so shoot at me. Quit groaning at me and just... Do something besides regenerate. Gosh. What am I supposed to do here? Threw fireballs and I was bouncing them back, but now they're working. Okay, this is just really loud and annoying. Gas trap. Oh, does this work? Really? Was this like Ghostbusters or some crap? Freak out. That's kind of cool. Whatever that's for. It must be like part of the castle to get through. Like without jetpacks and stuff. <sighs> Good grief. Okay, so this is getting rather annoying. We're just kind of like sitting here twiddling our thumbs. He's flying around groaning, being all loud, and I'm not getting anywhere at all. So, this sucks, and I don't know what to do here, so, if anybody knows how to kill the Eurogast or get him to actually throw fireballs, that would be much appreciated. Okay, yeah, this, is, this dude's just way too effing loud. Yep, no, can't do it. <clears throat> but, I thought it would be kind of cool to, <laughs> at least... 
and go record that right quick because he said he found that almost as soon as I got done recording so uh, once again thanks for watching and oh no wonder my little helmet is gone somehow uh, did I take it off? did I lose it? oh no well <laughs> some mystery here uh, I seem to have lost my helmet and I'm going to have to figure out where it went to, but until then, thanks oh so much for watching. Uh, be sure not to like the video, but if you do uh, like it, or you want to see something else done, or just me doing something, I don't know, just leave me a comment, let me know.